What's up guys, this is Nick Edson, and today I'm going to show you how to measure yourself at the NBA Combine. I'm going to show you hand length and hand width measurements, I'm going to show you height, height without shoes, weight, age, body fat percentage, wingspan, vertical reach, no step vertical, and two step vertical. Alright guys, let's get inside and do it and see where I stack up to some of the NBA prospects. Alright guys, the first one we have is height, pretty simple, I'll fast forward it for you. So I'm 6'2.5 without shoes. Second one is height with shoes. 6'3.75 with shoes. Next one is weight. I come in at 197 pounds. All right, the next one is body fat percentage. Uh, there's multiple ways to measure body fat percentage. Uh, some people, you can use machines. And the way I'm going to show you right here is to estimate it. And what we do is we measure our waist around the thinnest point. For me, it's 33 inches. Then if you simply Google body fat percentage calculator, you put in that measurement along with your weight, and it spits you out a percentage, and for me, it's 13%. Next one is hand width. Um, as you can see, it's from your thumb to your pinky. For me, is 8.5 inches. Next one is hand length, which is from where your wrist meets your hand at the bottom up to the highest point on your longest finger. For me, it is 7.5 inches. All right, the next one is wingspan, which is the length from finger to finger with your arms spread out. For me, it's about 62.5, which is right near my height. Next one is vertical reach, which is the length from your toes to the highest point you could reach up to. For me, it is about 8 feet, as you will see here. Remember this 8 feet because we're going to use this in the next one, the vertical jump one. Alright, at the NBA Combine, they test your vertical in two ways. One is a jump off no steps, like I'm going to show you here. And the second one is jump off two steps, which I'll show you next. So this is my jump off no steps. The rim is 120 inches high, plus 4 inches that I get above the rim, as you can see, equals 124 inches off the ground. Then if you subtract my 96 inch standing reach that we calculated earlier at 8 feet, it leaves you with a 28 inch vertical jump, and that's off 0 steps. And like I said, the second one is off two steps, as you can see. Alright, so it's going to be the same thing as last time. The rim is 120 inches high at 10 feet, plus I'm about 8 inches above the rim, as you can see. That equals 128 inches above the ground, minus my 96 inch standing reach, that we, which we calculated earlier equals a 32 inch vertical leap off two steps. Here's a summary of myself, um, everything that we've shown in this video uh, compared to um, four NBA draft prospects, Aaron Kraft, Marcus Smart, Jahi Carson, and Aaron Gordon. 